Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sagar Prajapati and in this video, I will be talking about how can we create a scope in Azure Databricks. Okay, so moving forward, I would like to introduce my channel that is Geek Coders and here I upload videos on Azure Data Factory, Spark, interview series and so on. If you are liking my content, you can subscribe to my channel and share with your friends so that everyone will get benefited. So moving forward, I will tell you what steps I will perform today. So we have an Azure Databricks, okay, and right now we have nothing there. What we will do, we will create a scope in Databricks to attach or to link my key vault with it, okay. So go back to the Azure Databricks. Right now you can see we have nothing here, right and we do not and we have a key vault that is key vault geek coders and we have some keys well, what i want to do i want to fetch the keys or the password from key vault into my database so for that what we need to do we need to we need to create a scope so what you need to do you need to copy this path and paste it over here okay Once it is done, then you can see we have an option of create secret scope. Now we have to choose. Now we have to choose the geek scope uh, name. So what I will choose, I will choose geek coders dev. Here we have an option of manage principal that is creator and all user. Okay. So I cannot use creator since I am not like this workspace is not a premium plan and un under premium plan so i will have to use all users here i what i want to do i want to uh, pass my azure key vault okay so what i will do i will go to this and i if i go to my properties button then you can see we have uh, the link copy it paste it over here then i have to pass resource id so what i will do i will pass this resource id and paste it over here. Now you can see we have an option of create. Once click on it, it is done. Okay, now we have created our scope. Now if you want to fetch the records, then we can fetch it. Right now, I do not have any cluster present here, so I will not be uh, telling you how can we fetch the secrets and the keys and everything using keyword. So in the next video, I will tell you how can we do that. So I hope you have uh, liked the video. If you do, do subscribe and share.